Hello everyone, let's unlock the trick to solve the balancing equation. So for these kind of questions, we need to start balancing from carbon followed by hydrogen and then the oxygen. So how do we balance? We start from carbon, hydrogen and oxygen. Okay, for the first question, how many number of carbons are on the left side? We have one carbon on the left side and one carbon on the right side. And we have four, so it's balanced. Carbon is balanced by itself. And then we'll go for an hydrogen. We have four hydrogen on the left side and two hydrogen on the right side. So we need to balance this. What I will do? I simply had two in front of hydrogen, which means now we have two times two, four hydrogen. So our hydrogen is also balanced now. Carbon also balanced. Now we'll go for an oxygen. How many oxygens we have on the right side? Two plus two times one, which is two plus two four oxygens on the right side we have to make four on the left side so what i will do i will add two in front of oxygen now our oxygen is also balanced so how many number of carbons on the left side one and hydrogen on the left side four and oxygen on the left side four carbon on the right side one hydrogen on the right side two times two four Oxygen on the right side, 2 plus 2, 4. So our equation is balanced. Now we'll go for the second one. So same way, we have 3 carbons on the left side, 1 carbon on the right side. So I need to make this as 3. I will add 3 in front of carbon. So carbon is balanced. How many hydrogens I have now? 8 hydrogens on the left side, 2 hydrogens on the right side. So what I do, I add 4 in front of hydrogen. So 4 times 2 makes 8. Okay, hydrogen is balanced. And how many number of oxygens are there? 3 times 2, 6. Plus 4 times 1, 4. So which is 10. 10 oxygens are there on the right side. I need to make 10 on the left side as well. So I had 5 in front of oxygen. So 5 times 2, 10. I think my equation is balanced now. So 3 carbons, 8 hydrogens, 10 oxygens on the left side. 3 carbons, 8 hydrogens and 10 oxygen on the right side. So our equation is balanced. Now we'll go for the next question with a bigger number. So we have 10 carbons on the left side whereas 1 carbon on the right side. So what do I make? I write 10 in front of carbon. So my carbon is balanced. Now we'll go for an hydrogen. How many hydrogens are there on the left? We have 22 hydrogens on the left side.